Hi, Linda. Hello. Hi, hi. 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 Nice seeing you again. Yeah. Uh, I can tell you a story. Yeah, okay. And one day I was supposed to meet a friend, uh, but my friend said, no, I can't meet you. And I got a bit disappointed. Okay. And then, then another friend was supposed to pick me up and he called me and said, sorry, I have to go to the airport to leave something for my daughter that is traveling. And then I, I got very disappointed and I thought, uh, disappointment is here. Disappointment is visiting me. Oh, and I thought, oh. okay, I go out for a walk and just, yeah, try to be quiet. Uh, and I came to a road and a man nearly got hit by a bus. Uh, and he got, nothing happened, but he got, re got really scared. But right. it, ended, it ended up, we spent three hours together and we had such a nice time. <laughs> <laughs> so that's a lot of magic. Yeah, because we were walking the same direction and talking and talking and talking. And then when we stopped, I was supposed to go another direction. And he said, can I inv invite you for dinner? We go and eat somewhere. And I thought, what the hell? And I said, yes. And <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> that was great. Wow. So it, it's I, amazing, used, huh? it's I amazing. used that technique, disappointment is visiting me and I had the best day. <laughs> <laughs> it's, uh, thank you for really sharing this because what, what normally people do is they go into this funk of getting depressed or getting very negative that life sucks and coming up with all these different stories yeah and, and what you did is basically you turned the poison into medicine yes <laughs> you you see someone taught me what's that someone taught me yeah <laughs> yeah but but well thank you but you, you just see that how incredible it is by simply not being attached to the outcomes that two people canceled on you and you did get a disappointment, but you didn't even get involved with disappointment. You saw it coming and you observed it and you moved on. It didn't touch your, your bliss. It didn't touch your silence. And then magically out of that, another situation was created. Yeah. And it turned to be an incredible experience. I'm very happy to hear that. Yeah, thank yeah. you. Yeah, that's really, thank you for sharing it. We all need yeah. to hear that. Yeah, cause I say. <laughs> cause what? Say that again, I'm sorry. I had an amazing day, even though I got cancelled two times. <laughs> so, yeah. You know, Thank it shows that, uh, that life is infinite and anything at any moment can happen, even, and you have no idea. But when you're not really set on a certain way that things has to be this way, and you're open, you're open to life, you're out of the box, and anything can happen at any moment. You have opened the window to the light. Monica, hello. Hello. <laughs> how, how was your drive back home? Would it was uh, wonderful. We wonderful. Uh, uh, drive through Dalek Kaya, Dalarna, okay. and uh, spend uh, a night there before we went back to Stockholm. And the car was fine, no problem. Yes, okay. yes. Now it was mended. Right. <laughs> and the first week when I got home, I got a tremendous energy. So I. Uh, and I was so happy and felt so much love. But this week, the second week, uh, depression is 
visiting me. I know to handle it. Beautiful. Right? Yes. Yeah. Um, well, I'm, I'm happy to hear that you have the tools to see it and not get identified with it. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, it's another plus pa passing cloud. Yes. Right. Soon it's going to be gone and yes. you're going to see this blue sky and, and sunshine. Oh, yes. And Miss Marit, hello, hello. Hello. Yeah, can you talk a little bit louder, please? Yeah, I can. Hello there. Yeah, how are you? I'm fine. Ba back in back in the Norge. Yes. Yeah. Back in the summer. Yeah. Twenty-four degrees. What? Oh. We have 24 degrees. Yeah, I've been, you know, I've been checking out the, the uh, weather temperature. Yeah, I can see. Yes. It's <laughs> 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 oh, See, it's 11 o'clock. Okay. Uh, let's see. Hi, Anita. Hi. How are you? <laughs> yeah, fine. <laughs> okay. What? Well, where? Where do you live? What country are you in? Yes, I'm from Germany, Frankfurt. Frankfurt. Okay. Okay. Yes. Yeah. I watched. I watched all your uh, videos and uh, everything what you've done in R. It was really wonderful. I was a little bit jealous. <laughs> what kind of things uh, is happening there? Right. Yeah. Right. Well, maybe next year you can make it there. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> yeah, so we'll see what happens. I'm going to be in Frankfurt in October. Third of October, I'll be there for 10 days. So, oh. right. And uh, are you friends with Suzanne? Do you know each other? Can no. you? No. Let's uh -huh. see. Hi, Suzanne. Do, do Hi, Zaratustra. You know? Yeah. No, we didn't meet, but maybe you can share my phone number. Yeah, absolutely. If um, can, that would be great. Yeah. yeah. You, don't, you don't see each other right now on on the on your screens, do you? No, no, no. no. Okay. No. First time I saw her. <laughs> okay. Right. Because I I live in the townis area, but I work in Frankfurt, and maybe we can have a coffee together. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay, that would be lovely. Are you? Because I brought the bliss to Frankfurt. Uh, yeah. Ah, <laughs> that's interesting. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah. That's really interesting. <laughs> Yesterday night, I went out with with four colleagues of mine, and we it, it was really hot, but we had so much fun together, and. My experience is also that this kind of bliss or that love is, is spreading to the other people also in the office. Uh -huh. I'm very yeah. happy to hear that. Yeah, exactly. So, yeah, exactly. I don't do anything, but it's, exactly. it's uh, working. Yeah, I brought it from Aura. <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful. And you're right back. You you went back with uh, Boris. You were yes. Yeah. Yeah. We were traveling together, and uh, yeah, it it was a nice day. I mean, we were sitting in Stockholm like for five hours because they were not allowed to fly to Frankfurt because of thunderstorms or what have you. So it was uh, a whole day. Okay. It took us to go back to Frankfurt. Right. So anyway. but you, you were in Stockholm, you were in a city, you probably were uh, in the No, center. we were stuck in the airport. Airport. A, okay. a few hours stuck in the airplane. We were sitting there and I mean, for two and a half hours, they didn't allow us to uh, leave the plane. And okay. it was quite challenging. 
I bet it's very uncomfortable just staying yes. there for two and a half yeah. hours. I so, hear you. Yeah, it was uh, quite a challenge <laughs> to go back to Frankfurt, but we managed. 